As soon as word spread that the smoker at Barbecue Pit was once again heating up, a crowd lined up. I only opened today because there were too many people coming saying, when do you go open, when do you go open, when do you go open, when do you go open? And so I figured that, you know, I had to open on the 4th because this is a rib day. Regulars will recognize owner Pookie and his signature ribs. He lost his old Central District storefront about a year ago when developers moved in and was able to relocate to this spot on Yesler, where another longtime barbecue joint happened to be closing. You got right now close to 70, 80 years of barbecue in this building. From Martin Luther King Jr. to Jimi Hendrix, the walls tell the stories of some of the icons who've dined here. A team of business students from Seattle U is helping Pookie get settled in his new spot. They're part of a program that helps longtime Central District small businesses survive gentrification. I mean, one, she designed my on-screen menu. Uh, there's another one I'm working with right now that she's doing all my social media, you know, advertisement. By dinner time, Barbecue Pit was pretty much sold out, a sign that the community still craves a Seattle original. There's a lot of generations and a lot of people of all spectrums that this place has touched. Ted Land, King 5 News.